hi guys welcome to my channel it support people this is masood in this video i'll show you how to reset cisco access point to factory default setting using mode button let's get started please don't forget to subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so that you'll be notified about the all the latest video which i'll create in future this is the front side of my uh, cisco access point and this is the back side of the access point you can see the model this is a cisco aeronet 3602i standalone access point now i will show you the physical connection uh, here you can see uh, this is a, a cisco 2800 series router and this one is my cisco catalyst uh, 3560 port poe switch this one is a poe switch and uh, the connection in the first ethernet port of this switch is coming from this router and the connection the ethernet cable in the first ethernet port 5 which is uh, goes to the ethernet port of the access point and uh, this one is the console port and here you can see uh, down here is a black uh, this one is the mode button here is written mode this is the mode button one thing i want to mention here that you can see there is no external power cable in the access point uh, because uh, my switch this switch is a poe switch that's why it's getting power through the ethernet cable so it's getting power through the ethernet cable so if your switch is not poe switch then you need a poe injector like this uh, this is a tp link poe injector uh, this is the power uh, connection and you can see this is a lan in and the other side is uh, power or data this is lan out so you can use uh, this type of poe injector now i will connect the console cable to access point yes I just connected the console cable to access point. Now I will uh, access uh, the uh, Cisco access point uh, through party. So before doing this, I have to check the COM port number. So I just type here device manager. Device manager, yes, go to device manager. And um, yes, then go to port. Here uh, I can see the serial port is COM9. So now I will go to party, open party. Make sure you uh, select the serial and I'll change it to COM port 9 and open uh, now press enter yes we successfully access the cisco access point now i'll go to privilege mode uh, type enable yes it's asking the password password is uh, cisco c is capital c i s c o c is capital yes uh, we enter the privilege mode uh, before doing the reset uh, i'll quickly check the version of this access point to check the version just uh, show version to show the version Yes, uh, you can see the Cisco iOS software version AP3G2K9W7. W7 means uh, it's a standalone or autonomous. If it is W8, then it would be lightweight version. So uh, now I will check the uh, flash drive. So show flash. So these are the files are stored in the flash drive. So now, uh, now I will show how to uh, reset the access point using mode button. And it's recommended by Cisco uh, before doing any configuration. Uh, it's recommended to reset the access point we can reset the cisco access point following uh, these three easy steps step one we have to disconnect the power cable or ethernet uh, cable from the access point and then step two we have to press and hold the mode button and uh, we have to reconnect the ethernet or power cable to the access point and the step three is uh, we have to hold the mode button until the led light uh, turns to amber and uh, uh, it normally takes 10 to 12 seconds to reset the access point. Now I will show you how to reset uh, the Cisco access point uh, with the mode button. To reset the Cisco access point, you have to press the mode button. Yeah, I just press the mode button with my uh, left thumb mode button and just take out the Ethernet cable. Yeah. So yeah, release the mode button. Then now again uh, press the mode button. Yeah, I press the mode button and. Uh, you have to put back the ethernet cable again yeah yeah you, you can see in the the light is flashing green so still i'm pressing the mode button so i have to uh, hold the mode button until uh, the light changes to amber so you can see yeah the light changes to amber i release the mode button now it's uh, resetting the access point 
I am just skipping this portion. Yeah, you can see uh, it already been reset. You can check hostname has already been changed before uh, before the reset. You can see the hostname was ap1. So now the hostname has changed. Yes, uh, uh, the reset is done. Now we will uh, uh, go to privilege mode in above and password is Cisco C A S C O capital C. Uh, first, we will change the uh, access point hostname. So now it is ap dot home dot. So we'll uh, change it to ap. So go to configuration mode, config configuration terminal. Uh, we will change it the uh, hostname hostname only api okay so we'll make it permanent so we'll uh, do copy run start yes confirm so you see now the hostname has been changed before it was api dot home dot now it is api so exit so finally we have reset uh, the cisco access point using mode button and uh, we change the host name so thanks for watching if you think this video is helpful please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel and you can let me know any queries through comments your little appreciation will inspire me to make the next video thanks for watching